Hey YouTube, what's going on? This is iTalk here and in today's video we have a brand new video guys we are so close to chapter three it's not even funny we are two days away from the event which is the end it's going to be the end of chapter two i'm super excited about it and one thing i wanted to kind of talk about today is i wanted to talk about 10 reasons why you should be excited for chapter three i feel like with chapter two a lot of people kind of lost the luster for Fortnite. it's been going on too long there's not enough changes to the map but I think with the introduction of chapter three, a lot of that is going to change. So I wanted to go over 10 reasons why you should probably be really excited for chapter three. Number one, the most important thing that everyone's gonna care about the most is the new map. Obviously we're going to be getting a new map most likely and that should be amazing. I don't know what it's gonna look like. I don't know what they're gonna do with it. If you wanna know my personal guess on what they could do with this new map, they probably saw all the complaining in the very beginning of chapter two a lot of people said chapter one map was better than chapter two in like the first few days i i feel like half of that was trolling but i feel like half of that was actually kind of sincere like the chapter one map had more character you remembered all the locations i mean i'm not gonna lie with chapter two i barely remember many of these locations just like none of them really stuck out to me so much like chapter one's map had so much personality and so much attention to detail and while i think the chapter two map did as well chapter one just had all the charm it had the most retention obviously people cared about the chapter one map so what i think they're going to do is they're going to make a combination of the chapter one map and the chapter two map and they're going to make that into the chapter three map i'm thinking what they're going to do is instead of the chapter one locations we have now which is like retail row and pleasant park i think what they're going to do is they're going to change that up i think we're going to get tilted towers back finally i think we might get junk junction back i think we might get haunted hills back i think we might get lucky landing back i think we might get all these crazy locations that we all remember and miss and i think that'd be great and then i think what they could do for like chapter two locations i think they could do like craggy cliffs again and they could probably do some other ones like lazy lake i could see them doing that but that's just how i feel like they're gonna do it and then we'll probably get some brand new locations we've never seen before in the chapter three map and that's what's so awesome about it is that the anticipation of everything like we have zero idea what this map is going to look like we don't know anything like this is what makes this so special is that we're so blind to this like we we usually have leaks to actually help us and figure out like oh this is what's going to happen with the map and stuff like that but it actually came out that a bunch of people from epic told leakers to not leak anything relating to chapter three whatsoever so we're going to be going in this completely blind and i'm very excited for that so yes the new map is going to be the biggest thing for everyone to think about but also what about the new guns what are they going to do with the guns i think what they might do is what they did with chapter two season one where we got barely anything in terms of like the current loot pool like i think they're going to strip back everything i think we might get like two ars two smgs two shotguns and a sniper maybe maybe and I think that's all they're gonna do and they'll give us some heals and stuff but I firmly believe that they're gonna like make it very bare bones in the beginning and then they're going to expand upon it I think they learned their lesson from chapter 2 season 1 that just because you give us a brand new chapter does not necessarily mean that people are going to love your season the lack of updates really killed the hype for chapter 2 at least I feel like it did it went on for way too long it went on for four months they definitely need to change that up a bit and I think with the addition of new weaponry I think they could absolutely do that moving on from that new UI I remember when we first landed in chapter 2 the crazy UI changes I mean the health used to be in the middle of your screen now it's on the bottom left now and that's you know that sounds like insignificant but it's kind of a big deal i feel like having a new ui i think is almost confirmed at this point because again i'm kind of just i'm relating everything from like what we got in chapter two and thinking that majority of stuff that we got from chapter one to chapter two is going to happen with chapter two to chapter three so new ui i feel like we would get something like that also new graphics it has been confirmed that we will be on the unreal engine 5 for chapter three so new graphics better graphics very excited to see what they do with that also new event we get a new event starting in two days and that's going to lead up to chapter three i'm probably guessing here that they're going to do what they did with the black hole where we're just stuck for two days and then we'll get the game back up on monday if i had to take a guess it'd probably be on the 7th of december and the event should be amazing it's in two days i'm thrilled for it man 
there's just so much to get excited about that I'm just like losing track on everything. Also, new storyline. While I am not the biggest fan of the story, and not saying that because I don't care about it, but just because it's really confusing, I am really excited to know what they do with this next chapter in terms of storyline. Also, new lighting. I do feel like they will give us some new lighting here in the game, and I do hope it goes back to like the cartoony route and not make it look so serious like they did with Chapter 2. I would like it if they went more in the cartoony route like they did back in Chapter 1, and I think lighting actually plays a really big part in that. Also, new battle pass. I actually completely forgot that we get a new battle pass when chapter three starts. I genuinely forgot that we're getting a new battle pass and stuff. And that's also very exciting. I'm curious to know what they do with that. Maybe we'll get something new in terms of like new cosmetics, maybe gun charms, maybe new LTMs. My favorite thing I want is I want there to be a first person mode with no building just so you could see your gun and everything. And I think if they give us charms, I think that would really help build a first person LTM to actually make its way into the game because that way you could actually see the charm a lot more than if you were in third person but even when you're in third person you could still kind of see it I think with like a first person mode you could really see that and you know maybe we'll get more cosmetic types and I would really like that maybe calling cards titles and emblems more customization to your character I think that would be a really cool idea. I mean, I just played Fall Guys recently, and they have like a calling card system. I don't see why Fortnite can't do something like that. Also, new experiences. You get to experience new things with your friends and even with some randoms and stuff. And I think it's going to be great. I think just starting over to a new chapter is really going to bring more people back to the game and i think it's going to bring more experiences to the game as well and then finally i'm expecting something new for creative i'm excited to see what they actually do with the whole creative department because there's been rumors about a creative 2.0 in the works we don't know if that's coming out for chapter 3 but what we do know is that it should be coming out in the lifespan of chapter 3 if chapter 3 lasts two years like it has with all the other chapters i feel like 2.0 would come out by that point and it should be insane with the modding tools and what they might allow you to do with it, there's a lot to be excited about with chapter three. And I guarantee you, I probably missed some things, but that's what I wanted to talk about today, guys. I'm super thrilled for this next chapter. I'm enjoying the game right now. I want to just play the map. I want to play the map and I want to remember it. And I don't want to feel like, you know, did I waste my time not playing the game, right? Like, I really do hope that I miss this map. I really do. But guys, that is it for the video today. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, let me know with a like and subscribe to the channel if you're brand new. And if you'd like to use me for support a creator, my code is ITF. You all have yourselves a wonderful day or night, and I will talk to you all later. See ya.